In a city like New York, distributed functions cover everyday activities from transportation to garbage collection. And it is very important for smart citizens to take full advantage of the tools that are becoming available to empower them understanding better how their city works and leverage everything possible to make their lives not only more efficient but also more enjoyable. Fulfilling the opportunities that a city like New York gives is certainly complex and elected officials and city agencies are working hard to make open data platforms available so that the creativity of developers can enhance what is otherwise designed and developed on a central manner. Centralized systems have been extremely successful in aggregating functions and power, not only nation states, uh, but uh, uh, enterprises. And uh, they are accustomed to work in five-year plans, in long-term investments, and uh, analyzing their returns and interactions over long periods of time. In today's rapidly changing uh, technological landscape, it is, however, better to concentrate on shorter periods of planning on more rapid interactions of different fields. This is one of the reasons why it is better to organize activities in a network-like distributed structure rather than a centralized hierarchical one. In cities, this means that a new model is necessary for unleashing these possibilities. Relenting centralized control is going to be difficult, not only from a technological point of view, where interoperability becomes fundamentally important and open systems must be put in place, but it is also going to be a challenge from a legal and policy point of view so that the networks can provide their value in an unfettered manner. There are several technological developments that are pointing in the direction of distributed and decentralized systems. In energy production, solar photovoltaic panels and corresponding battery technologies, of course. In manufacturing, 3D printing, uh, that is decoupling the value generated through the complexity of the objects designed from the capital availability uh, of uh, the production plants themselves. Learning platforms that make knowledge available and accessible to everybody. Smart health, personalized medicine, not only uh, from the point of view of cures, but even more importantly, being able to prevent a state of illness to start with. Very importantly, finance is also a technology. And cryptocurrencies, chiefly Bitcoin, allow decentralized transactions and financial systems to emerge, supplementing or even replacing the centralized ones. Analyzing and quickly revising policies is fundamental in a rapidly changing technological landscape. New York City um, last year co uh, convened uh, a public hearing about cryptocurrencies and Bitcoin. And after that hearing, in a few months, uh, issued draft uh, regulations around Bitcoin that horrified the community. Uh, it was so uh, restrictive and perceived as being extremely backwards. However, what it happened is that a few months later, a new draft of these uh, regulations has been uh, um, uh, made available publicly for further commenting before their final adoption. And this draft was much better than the first one. With the flexibility of working environments, uh, co-working spaces are becoming extremely popular, as well as the possibility for more and more work to be done remotely. It is interesting to ask oneself what will happen to uh, office buildings like New York skyscrapers uh, when 
nobody will go to work, but uh, they will be able to work uh, from uh, wherever they are. It's called the needle skyscraper format, and uh, it is a new construction type that, uh, rather than being built on an entire city block, it is built just uh, on, a, on, a, on a fraction of a city block. One of the sectors that is really prone for disruption is uh, that of healthcare. Especially in the United States, but also in Europe, an enormous amount of money is spent on people trying to get better, often very inefficiently. Personalized health is going to be profoundly impacted by new devices that are sensor-laden and uh, through apps uh, enable everybody to monitor their state of health. Apple Watch is going to be in the forefront of this uh, through the health kit platform that uh, will spur the creation of uh, thousands, tens of thousands and hundreds of thousands of uh, applications that uh, will use these sensors and uh, an entire family of solutions being born around them extremely uh, creatively.